Uh, let me get set up here. Oh my goodness gracious. Uh, Jesus. Welcome back, everyone. God damn. I was feeling cold, so I had to go get my sweater. Mm. I guess you could say I was feeling kind of chilly. Uh, let me take a sip of my drink first. I should probably reintroduce myself. Nope. Let's do it. I want to ask you something. Why did Mr. Kamashida change all of a sudden? He grew a conscience? Is that your hypothesis? It's still too sudden. I believe it's only natural to think that something might have caused it. Well, that's fine. Thanks for your valuable, valuable opinion. I'll take it into account. Mm. Hey, there you are. Hmm. I need your help with something. Really? Found this flyer stuffed in my mailbox. <gasps> Made <laughs> housekeeping service? Whoa. Kawaii meido ga ga anata no mono ni. Oh wait, I don't think that's my, whatever. I'm too lazy to read. I don't have my glasses on. I'm reading this kanji on this small screen is kind of hard. Ugh. Uh, okay, hold on. It says that it says that a cute maid will do anything for you. I mean, dude, a maid will do anything for you. Right? Right? <laughs> well, fucking shit, dude. Uh, well, what are you gonna do about it? What do you want me to do? You're a guy, right? You know what I mean? Let's give it a try. Yeah, yeah. Dude, luckily some guy on my floor just moved out, so there's a vacant apartment in my complex. The key is behind the mailbox, so we can get in anytime. The landlord seriously doesn't care. The place is all set, so- Wait, you're gonna freeload the place? What the fuck? Nah, nah. Hey, I heard that. I heard Mishima. Uh, what the hell? What the heck? Uh, can I, uh, get in on this? Oh, oh you mean you can do this kind of stuff, eh? Woo, okay. I'm not into it, it's just for my research. What does it mean that they'll do anything? And do the maids look exactly as they're advertised? We need to determine whether or not this company just pretends to offer housekeeping services. Uh, well, I guess we have to do it. I'm not, I'm not going to stop them. 10 out of 10. Right? And if it's a scam, then we need to punish them. Yeah, we got to see it with our own eyes. <laughs> Every little detail. <laughs> Uh, we'll have to do this at night, so let us know when you're ready. So, what's the code name for this operation? Hmm. Yes. Since we'll be watching them, it should be something like Operation Maid Watch. Wow. Nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Whew. Mm-hmm. Uh, the pollen's bad today. If a lot of people are suffering from pollen allergies, it might be affecting mementos too. No. Shouldn't you tell the others about what Mishima told you? Let's go to Shibuya. Buya. Um. And what the fuck? Let's just go to Central Street. Whatever. <laughs> Whoa! What the fuck? Are you here again? No! God damn it! Fucked it up. Think sh she's still gonna be here? Oh, here she here. Here they come. Hello. Hello. How?
How are we gonna cheese this? Okay, hold on. I I know. Well, we can't do it. We, I just can't do it, Captain. I don't have the power. Uh, hello? Okay. The bookstore. Welcome, the popular books are over there. Mmm. Mmm. Playing the game. Nightlife hotspots. Uh, let's uh, let's just get all of this shit, actually. Mmm. Okay, hold on. Medjet Menace. A book on the hacker group Medjet. Be knowledgeable about internet crimes. Sure. Weekend Parks. A book that introduces great parks for spending a quiet weekend. Vague. A girl of my fashion magazine for girls with unique tastes. Instead of Vogue. <laughs> Wise Men's Words. A book of quotes by great philosophers. Read to enrich... Read to enrich your knowledge. Nightlife Hotspots. Magazine showing. Uh, date spots geared toward adults. Tidying the heart, the best seller on cleaning. Yeah, the proficiency is worth studying. Oops. A heartwarming tale of Doggett's Master. Yeah, playing the game. Thank you very much. Hey. Oh, hello. Are you alone? Are you going to meet Sakamoto-kun and Takamaki-san? Uh, I don't mean to pry, I'm just some wondering. Wow. That's some next level stalking. Great. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, let's go to the convenience store. Hold on. We got a message from... Oh, never mind. Fuck that guy. It's a dude. I had no... Okay. Uh, yeah, whatever. Not... What the... Are you really stalking me? Hello? What the fuck? Scary shizzle. Uh, wait, what's on sale? I mean, whatever, just buy it, dude. I'll go to work. Hi, oh, you're coming in today. That's so helpful. Mm. Holy fuck, there's a lot of customers. A lot of customers here today. Hang in there, Gebato-kun. What a huge line. This looks tough, especially since you're still sort of new at this. I could go for one of those hot dogs. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Phew. I think we survived the worst of that rush of customers. You were great today. We were able to get people in and out pretty smoothly. I'm sure you can count on getting some pretty good pay today. You were a huge help for me, too. Keep up the good work. Uh, this better be a shit ton of money, man. Good work. Very nice. You seem pretty busy today. <clears throat> you've got... You've done great dealing with customers today. I'm sure you can look forward to your pay. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Well, we got the money back. We spent on books a bit. It's fine. It's fine. <clears throat> I'll change and go home. Hey, you didn't forget, did you? You know about that flyer? We need to look into the truth behind that housekeeping service. I'm over at Central Street right now, so come talk to me if you're interested. Looks like Mishima's waiting for us in Shibuya. Do you think we should go see him? Nope. Fuck Mishima. When talking about juvenile crime, you often hear about probation from reforming repentant offenders. What? Now, when it comes to probation, overseas travel is prohibited. Probation officers are unpaid. Uh, this seems weird. Which one of these statements is true? Uh, probation officers are unpaid. Apparently, that's what the guide says. Correct answer is B. Probation officers don't receive a salary. Probation officers are civil volunteers. They are only paid the necessary amount when providing a report. Since probation is intended to encourage rehabilitation, overseas travel is not prohibited. Oh, you got it right. It's pretty amazing that the chief is doing this for no pay, though. Hmm. I feel like I've improved my knowledge. It's true. Weird. 
Knowledge has improved. Um, let me check my personas. We have the moon. Uh, that's fine. Let's go. Oh, hold on. We can just check the message, right? Uh, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, yeah, we, we should head over. I'll be waiting. Oh my god, I just farted. Oh, but don't flake out of me, okay? Please. Sheesh. Oh, chill the fuck out, man. <sighs> hey. My wife went to Madarami's exhibit, and now she's all about art. She wants to buy artwork and learn how to paint. We can't, we can't afford any of that. Haha, <laughs> the exhibit's just a talk of town. It's just a fad. I'm sure everyone forget about it soon. So true. You know, I'm kind of biased about Madarami. Even in this recession, he must be making a lot of money. Do you remember that group a while back who were claiming to hack websites in the name of justice? I have pretty high hopes for them. They turned to be posers, but I find a few true heroes that I want to help however I can. <laughs> so we're executing Operation Maidwatch tonight for sure, right? Alright, let's do it. Yes. Sweet, I've been waiting for this. Wait, you already changed out of your uniform? I guess that's a pretty good idea. We're meeting over at Sakamoto's place, right? Let's stop by mine beforehand so I can change too. Alright. So, we're really gonna do this, huh? You think it'll be okay? Operation Maid Watch, bro. Yeah, Operation Maid Watch. Well... If it turns out to be sketchy, we can just bail. The apartment's vacant, so it's not like we're messing with anyone's home. Wow. That's some next level shit, bro. Why are you in someone's apartment you don't own? Why are you acting like you're living here? What the fuck? You're a genius, Ruji. Yeah, I know. To think Sakamoto has a brain. But if that's the case, then... Then... Yep. Okay, give him a call. Hmm. Oh my god, I need to fart again. Oh, fuck off. Well. Oh fuck, I fucked it up. I wanted to sound cool. <sighs> Whatever, let's not try it. Makasero. Thank you for calling. This is Victoria's housekeeping. They answered. What? Shh. Uh, I take it you're interested in our services then. S services. Is there anyone in particular you'd like to request? Huh? Uh, anyone we want to request? Uh, what should we do, Flocker? Uh, well, fuck me if I know. Uh. Send anyone. Dare demo easy. Very well, let's see here. We have a maid available in 20 minutes. May I ask for your address? Shit, this is really happening. The maid services. Hey, what should we do? <laughs> what should we have her do? I was thinking she would start with some cooking. Of course, I wouldn't mind some of the other services either. Should we hold a strategy meeting to discuss? It said 20 minutes, right? I gotta use the bathroom. Oh. It's almost time. <sighs> you were in there for a while. Are you okay? Hey, did you wash your hands? What? Huh? Who? Me? You're really nervous. <laughs> Are high school students even allowed to use this type of service? Huh? What do you mean, huh? You should have researched it. What if they find out who we are? How should I know? But why would... But why, why would how old you are matter when it comes to housekeeping? <laughs> we would have been screwed if uh, your number had shown up on their caller ID. ID, okay. Good evening, I'm from the housekeeping service. <laughs> what? Already? She's five minutes early. What do we do? I'm not mentally prepared. 
Oh man, imagine if it's like... What is this sensual music? What if it's like the, the school... Oh my god. Maybe it's like the school president? That seems like a fad. Hmm... <laughs> has to be the president, right? Oh, the door's unlocked. Uh, may I come in? I can't do it! I just don't have the power! And my stomach's acting up. And my hands are all sweaty. Okay, you handle the rest. And don't let her find out you're a high school student. <laughs> I've got your back just from way back. Like, from the balcony. <laughs> what? I can't do this either. Gibato, we'll leave it to you. <laughs> what? Oh my. She's kind of cute. But her face is probably going to be ugly. Yuji and Mishima fled to the balcony. Excuse me. Oh, there you are. Ooh, boy. <gasps> what the fuck, that voice? Is that the teacher? I'm going to fill your tired heart full of lovely energy. Meow. <laughs> I'm Becky, and I have the pleasure of serving you today. Whoa. Uh, I think that might be our... Uh, Ooh. Nice to meow to you. We're going to get along so well. Meow. <laughs> oh my, how thoughtless of me. I should explain our services to you, master. What would you like me to do today? The basics include cooking, cleaning, laundry, but there are other services we provide if you desire. What? Hmm, you look young, master. Are you perhaps in high school? I'm a dad. Wow, your skin's so healthy. You're not lying to me, are you? Hmm. 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 I'll wait to provide those other services un until you've matured a bit, master. What the fuck, dude? So, I'll be going now. What? No. Quiet. Someone there. Oh, shit. Shit. Run, Mishima. <laughs> Mishima Sakamoto-kun. Wait, what? And you? Mm. Yeah, it's her. It's definitely her. I recognize the eyes. Did you request me specifically? Uh, wait, are you? Oh no, it's all right. How would you know me? Oh my God, that face. Yeah, it's her. It's her. This is our first meeting. Yes, the first time ever, master. Ah, oh, this is unbelievable. Yes, it's me, your homeroom teacher. I'm so done. I can't believe I got caught by my, some of my own students. I should have taken a job outside the city, but I needed it to be close to school so I could go there after I finished work. Nah. Who did you hear about this from? Oh, it was Miss Chono, wasn't it? That harpy. Hey, she's hotter than you. Miss Chono, the English teacher. She's been snooping as usual ever since that incident with Mr. Kamashida. Are you going to tell Miss Chono about this? Hmm. <laughs> and that's up to you. Hey, you're going to side with a teacher, side with me. I'm in charge of your class, after all. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. What a sneeze. Hey, if you're going to side with a teacher, side with me, I'm in charge of your class, after all. That is the truest thing ever. And if you promise not to tell Miss Chona about this, I'll do anything for you. <gasps> Boggers, Spark Champ. Anything? Oh, hey, it won't be better. It won't be any better for you if people find out you called a maid service. This isn't even your home address to begin with, isn't it? I guess you at least thought about that. Well, I promise to keep this a secret too. So why don't we both forget this ever happened? I'll treat this as if you had cancelled, so you won't have to pay anything, okay? On that note, I'll be leaving. Don't say anything about this at school, okay? Just act as if nothing ever happened. 
Got it? Okay, bye. Wow, really? I suddenly feel exhausted. I want to go home. That's nutty, dude. Whew. Well, at least we didn't have to pay for shit. But now we know. And knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe! Ooh, we get to read. Uh, oh yeah, we haven't read our thing as well. Do we want to read a book? Let's read vague. Hmm. No, 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 no. <laughs> Takenoko girls are springing up like bamboo shoots. There are more of them every day. Hmm. Hmm. Takenoko Street over in Harajuku. Hmm. Hmm. You could learn about cutting edge fashions there, but I'd say what's on the inside is more important. Still, this place looks like fun. Almost like a team park. Taking someone there might be a pretty good idea. Oh. Naru Hodo. So you finished reading Vague. Harajuku seems to have a lot of cool shops. Takenoko Street is also seems also pre seems pretty interesting. Ah. Harajuku, the fashion capital, also no also known for studying many trends in food. Takenoko street fashion. Young people with unique fashion often gather here alongside tourists. Yes. All right, new new spot. Nice. Hmm. You should invite someone to go with you sometime. I can't imagine you as the fashionable type, though. Yeah, we used our time pretty damn well. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> hey, what are we gonna do about the Kawakami maid thing? It sounds like she was in trouble. Why don't you go ask her what's going on? She should be at school anyways, right? Do we have the right persona though? <laughs> wow, we have a Makami and we're going to Kawakami. Okay, so I know for sure she is going to be one of our next confidence can we talk no screw you benny screw you let's see oh fuck oh my god we get to see up her skirt can we do it i just can't do it captain yeah, she definitely is way hotter. Dude, look at that. My god, she looks ugly as fuck from here. Look at those things under her eyes. How does our teacher look? She actually looks hotter. Well, looks like we have a new favorite. Okay. As I've been saying, get home safely, Gabatokun. Well then, I had another matter to attend to, if you'll have to excuse me. No, we're not finished talking yet. But I... There's been a series of scandals on this captain campus. We're all being called into question, and yet you leave work earlier than anyone. You barely make it into the faculty meetings. Explain yourself. Don't tell me you're running out. You're running around at night. Kawakami's being grilled by Chono. She said she'd do anything if we helped her out, so let's clear up Chono's suspicions. The school's closing soon, Mr. Gabato. Get on, uh, head on home before it gets too late. But did you need something from Miss Kawakami? Hmm. I have a question for her. What? Oh, you have another question? Another question. That's right. Gabato-kun's questions are complicated, so I take time at night to help him. So, you're giving individual lessons out of school hours, hmm? What passion? You are the ideal teacher. As a passionate teacher, a passionate teacher is exactly what we need at the school. I'm sorry for suspecting you. Well then, keep up the hard work, you two. She just kind of convinced herself, but that did clear up her suspicion, so thanks. Could you come with me for a bit? Easy clap, dude. We can't talk about it, about this at school. This is the address and the phone number of my night job. Damn it. I was trying to score her real number. I received the phone number from Kawakami. Ka 
call at night and request me. Just be careful that it doesn't show up in your call history though, okay? Oh. Fuck, does that mean we need to use a payphone? That's nice going, man. No call history means public telephone. Let's call from LeBlanc's yellow phone. Okay. Let's call her over to your room the next time you're free at night. Ho <laughs> ho! Okay, I have to go. Bogers, dude. What the fuck? Yikes. Uh, hey, hold, hold on. Do you still say the same? Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, so, what are we gonna do? Let's see. see let's go sell our shit at the airsoft shop Ugh. what persona did I have on me okay hey you say something different you know about that capsule machine the one the army rations over by the entrance Apparently those rations are really gross and it's not just the flavor. There's something about, there's a lot about it that's gross. They're too pricey for me and maybe too risky, but if you're curious, why not give them a try? I never even realized this. It says, taste test, the rations of the world, volume 37. Cost 800 yen per try. Wanna give this a go? Fuck yeah. YOLO. Oatmeal ration. Maybe I'm imagining things, but for a split second, I thought I smelled something terrible. <laughs> Not too bad. What? What is this? Hello? Rancid gravy. Uh, did I miss it? Did I miss it? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, oatmeal ration. Hey, it's pretty good. Pretty good. One of the better items I've seen. You again? You gonna try to sell me something weird again? Uh. Yeah, no, my guts aren't high enough. Not enough guts. Hey. Nice. Hmm. Uh, how long have you been recording for? 28 minutes. Okay, well, I think it's uh, time to save. And I'll see you guys on the next episode. Until then, thanks for watching. <laughs>